I've been really looking forward to this interview. I love exploring kitchen design. That's my book, Kitchen Magic. Today's worldwide marketplace gives us so many more options, including American and European kitchen cabinets and appliances. There's some important differences to know. at the Hecker Kitchen Showroom in Greenwich, Connecticut to show you why Hecker cabinets and Miele appliance are the obvious choice for the Greenwich house. Mayana Ayer, an architect herself, recently opened the Hecker Showroom here right here in Greenwich. It is packed with great kitchen innovations. Hi Sabine, welcome to Hecker Greenwich. Hi Maya. You know our cabinet installers are still busy putting together the Hecker cabinets, but I already love them and I love the Miele appliances. As you know, as a native from Germany, I knew both brands really well, but I must say, seeing them right there at the Greenwich House, I'm in love. Hacker has been a global name brand, and right here in Greenwich, we have Hacker's flagship showroom. Uh, European kitchens have been making a presence in the modern homes in the U.S., and the reason being is people are liking the simpler, cleaner aesthetic. What are some of the key differences between European and American cabinetry? There are many, but before I actually show some of them to you, let's talk about the most important aspect, which is our health. So the, the difference is that at Hacker, they use VOC-free products and ingredients to create the cabinets that end up in your home. Let me show you some of the visual differences between Hacker cabinets and other name brands. Take, for instance, the drawer. We have full extension soft close drawers, not uncommon in the cabinet world, but in addition to that, what these drawers do is they carry up to 150 pounds. That changes the whole design. Absolutely, because now you don't have to rely on wall cabinets to house your heavy dishes. You can actually place them in drawers. And the drawers themselves are made of powder coated metal. They do have the option of having a glass side yes, to them. Yes, I saw that. I love that detail. Sabine, this is a great example of the European clean cabinet vernacular. These doors, all you have to do is pop them right there and the touch latch allows you to operate it without the use of handles. It's a seamless look. It's beautiful, very clean. I like it very much. And then we have the Hacker gives you amazing options like this channel that runs vertically between the cabinets that allows you to just hold the door panel and operate it. And then we have these amazing rollout shelves with the glass panels that we had talked about earlier. And in this case, you have the option of LED lights placed within the glass channels, which is amazing. When you're planning your kitchen, there are two primary things to consider. One being choosing a door style and mm -hmm. the other picking a finish. Like for instance, in the Greenwich house, we picked door styles and finishes for the entire home. Yeah, we had the kitchen, the bathroom vanities, and even the home office to do. Exactly. And we have selections from the slab door, the very contemporary clean look, to the transitional door styles with the recessed center panel, much like the shaker doors. Mm -hmm. And then we have the traditional doors with the beaded detailing, which is really cool as well. And as to the finish, from high gloss lacquer to matte lacquers to painted finishes, you have it all. Absolutely. There's these rich wood veneers that come in different colors. We have glass. We have stone veneers, believe it or not. It was really fun playing around here when we selected all of this stuff. Yes, it was. 
At the Greenwich House, we had a combination of touch latches, meaning no handles, but I wanted to have some handles in some places. Take mm -hmm. me through this board again. We offer a tremendous selection of hardware, right down to you know tra traditional options, and then we have the clean, contemporary, sleek ones. A lot of these models come in different lengths as well, which makes it very, very handy for the designer. Uh, I love this one right away because I love the way it feels. And of course, that is exactly the selection in the end. Yes, <laughs> it worked out really well. This particular one is very close to what we have on the Mila appliances that we have in your kitchen. Just as Hacker is the largest privately owned uh, kitchen cabinet manufacturer in Germany, Miele is actually the largest family owned appliance company in Germany. They come up with state of the art cutting edge appliances for the home. I love this induction cooktop. I think it's such a healthy way to cook. Absolutely. And you can pair it up with this beautiful downdraft hood and which can specially be designed into an island situation. Mm -hmm. We also at Mila have come up with amazing ranges, both gas in, and induction, as well as electric. Uh, at the Greenwich Home, we have the beautiful Mila gas range. Yeah, it's the, really the commercial range that Mila for a long time didn't have, but I'm so happy they now offer that. There are a couple other very important visual details in a kitchen, one being the vent hood. It no longer is just a functional element. It also has a design feature to it, like this one that Mila has come up with. It's beautiful with the glass, and of course it also has the built-in lights right here. Yes, and the filters can be stuck in the dishwasher to clean. Lighting in the Hacker Kitchen is not an afterthought. It really is designed into every cabinet and the entire space. For instance, we have the option of this uh, lighting uh, uh, solution where the entire floor of the wall cabinet is a sheet of LED light. So I see it lights the cabinet and it also lights the underside of the cabinet. Absolutely. Thank you, Maya, for showing us all these great details. I love the innovative thinking of both Hecker and Miele. I can't wait to see it all come together at the Greenwich House now, both the kitchen, the bathrooms, and of course the home office. Fabulous. Thank you for visiting, Sabine.